How to prepare your yerba mate. a filter on the end. Now we insert that into the mate here in the shallow end where I added the water nice and slowly and you press it till it gets right to the bottom and just make sure it's nice and secure there. Always keep the slope. Uh, the reason for the slope is so that we have some dry yerba mate at the top for when the flavor starts going out you can just pour on top of that and also we keep less yerba mate on this end where the filter is. You're just going to put your hand over it like that, give it a good shake and what you now want to do, and this is quite important, make a slope of the yerba mate in your gourd. So that's what you're looking for over there and now you're just going to carefully put that down so that you maintain your slope 